Hey YouTube Mod of the Investor, I have my return phone call that I need to do. Someone give me a call today and I'm gonna return this phone call. When? To, no, today. <laughs> I'm gonna return this phone call today and he uh, left me a message on my uh, voicemail. Hey, how are you, sir? This is Lamont. Is this Christopher? Yes, it is. How are you? I'm fantastic, sir. Thanks for asking. I, uh, I'm calling in regards to the voicemail that you left me about your property over there on Dove Tree. Yes. Yes. So is there any potential? Is there any interest for selling? I, I, I heard that, um, that uh, I, I'm assuming you're calling me because there could be some type of spark or some type of interest in selling your property. Is there, you know, would we be willing to listen to an offer? So, so you want to hear the offer? I'm always, absolutely. <laughs> All right. Do you happen to have a so so that we can understand, you know, where I'm coming from? Basically, what I do is buy property, and uh, what I do is I'm a wholesaler. I buy property, and then I look for any potential in the property to either fix and flip it or uh, rent it out to uh, other investors or I, uh, I can perhaps sell the property. But in this particular case, what I'm thinking about doing, because I have another property not too far from you, I have a property over there, five uh, dove tree that I'm doing a short sale on. Um, I'm working on that process with the uh, young lady down. I wanted to know, just ask, just ask some general questions about the property. Is there like a a note on the property? Is there a, still a lien or a mortgage on the property? Uh, we have a mortgage. It's not, there's no lien on the property. Gotcha. Now, are you actually in the home or you're renting it out? No, it's a, we, we rent it out. Renting it out. Okay. So they so you, you got a good tenant inside? I have a tenant. I don't know. If, you know, she's <laughs> been there for this is her third year. Third year. Um, okay. Through section section eight. So. Oh, okay, 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 okay. All right, I got you. So, no, I just want to make sure that there was some motivation or just check to see if there was any motivation in uh, you, you selling before uh, we put out a put out an offer. Because I'm looking online at the property, and uh, oh, let me double check. I'm on the wrong property. Hold on. Uh... Ah, here we go. I'm looking at the property here, and... It's going anywhere from like 117 to 130, to be honest with you. And if you still have a have a lien, I'm sorry, a mortgage on it, I don't want to, you know, give you no lowball offer or, or give you anything disrespectful. But I definitely want to make sure that we can come to an agreement and, and you know, maybe uh, we, we both can make this agreement happen. Is there any particular number or range you, you, you're willing to uh, accept an offer for? <laughs> right. Uh, you, like said, there's no, there is no need to sell it at the moment. Um, and it's not that we're not willing to sell it. And we're not trying to make any money off of it. At the same time, uh, when we bought the property, we paid uh, two hundred for it. Yep. And this was in two thousand six before you know the market crash. Uh huh. Um, we we're upside down on the loan right now. Gotcha. Um, and we're able to absorb some of that, but not, you know, $70,000. Understood. No. I, like, like like, I said, I just wanted to get some general, because I, I don't want to sit here and waste your time and give you a disrespectful offer. And and I, I appreciate the phone call you called me back, so I wanted to make sure it's something that we both can walk away with happy. So, um, being as though that's the case and you're kind of like, kind of upside down in it, and, you know, I know you don't want to do a short sale. You don't want to mess up your credit. And if you got a Section 8 tenant already in, I'm assuming Section 8 is doing well for you. And your tenant's actually, you know, I don't know how, how how well she's taking care of your house. But I know at least you're getting paid on time. All right. And that's, I mean, that's, to be honest with you, that's going to never matter. Right. I can fix most of the stuff they can break, so. Right, right. Exactly. So, I mean... 
it, 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 that that area over there seemed like the uh, value dropped drastically when the market crashed, and um, it's it's not really a good solid offer I can provide you without you know you having to come to the table with some money, and I don't want you to have to come to the table with money. Unless you have to, unless it's something you got to really, really get rid of. But if this isn't something that you really, really need to get rid of, then, you know, it's, it's really no need for me to even make an offer. But I still want to, you know, make you an offer. But I don't want to make you anything disrespectful, though. No, I, I understand. I, like I said, I, I called you because, you know, if I ever did something, we'd something to say, I wanted to talk to you. And I just wanted to make sure that you Right, 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 right. Now, I, I, I see what I, what I do is I like the area and I try to blanket the area because I, I do like the properties in that area. And if that's it. Not really much I can do, but um, I wanted to make sure I reached out to him, understand the situation, which I do now. And a lot of people in those homes in that area, a bunch of folks uh, upside down because of the market, but. Still went ahead and, uh, you know, I didn't make him an offer, but I told him I can perhaps do some type of lease option. But, you know, he's, I don't want to press anything. There's all many, there's so many other deals out here. No need pressing anything. I've already given you guys a long video. I'm going to give you guys another one, but now hopefully not so long. <laughs> but stay tuned. Martin the Investor. See you guys later. Oh, follow me on IG. REI with Marty. I'm going to put the information down below. Ariba Durchi.